Hey everybody, Matt here. Thanks for stopping by. In today's video, I'm going to try and make this corner joint using 2x4s. So here's a SketchUp model I did of the joint. Just playing around with some basic ideas. I am drawing this with SketchUp Make 2017. This joint is made with three 2x4s, two of which are cut with some half lap joints, and the third 2x4, the green one, is not is only cut the length. So let me separate the the pieces so you can get a better idea. of how this looks. All right, so there's a half lap joint cut in the yellow piece, a half lap joint cut in the red piece, and then this end cut a little bit short. That leaves enough of a gap for the green 2x4 to be slid in. So let me try and move those pieces back. Again, this is SketchUp Make 2017. All right, so there's the joint. Now I want to cut this out of wood, 2 by 4s Glue it up and see how it looks. So this is my first attempt at cutting the pieces to make this three-way joint. Uh, you can tell that the wood I'm starting with is not flat, which is okay, I guess. It's just a prototype. So you can see the joints here. And all that's holding it together right now is glue. And you can see that some of the joints, I mean, they're not the most accurate. Some of the edges are proud. But if I wanted to secure this joint with some fasteners, what I could do is a couple of screws here, and then maybe a couple of shorter screws here. Here's my second attempt at cutting the pieces for this joint. 
cuts are made a lot more accurately this time. Again, the only thing that's holding this together is glue. And I'm just using standard 2x4s, which are not flat. So what I'm thinking is that the next time I make a workshop table, I can use this joint in all four corners. This would be the leg, this would be the side, and this would be the front. With the legs like this, I can add my leveling feet, of course, in all four corners. And on each side, I can put the hinged casters. So I think that'll work out pretty well.